I'm Paulie G, owner of uh, Paulie G's Greenpoint Pizza Joint, and I'm here to answer some questions for the Serious Each community today. Mo Sizzlax asks, what is one of the food memories that you have from your early days? My, my very earliest memories of food and, and, and my love for Italian food came from going to my grandmother's house every Sunday, almost every Sunday, because sometimes I went to my Jewish grandmother's house on Sundays. Uh, I would go to my grandmother's house, we'd eat at 2 p.m., and she made the most delicious sauce, just you know, a meat-based sauce. Very, um, it was, wasn't pulpy at all, and there's something about it that I really loved. And uh, she would make meatballs and sausage, of course. And I just loved having that pasta, mostly ziti. And uh, I also remember drinking ginger ale there. And to this day, when I eat pasta, I have to have an, uh, a glass of ginger ale with it. And sometimes I have some Dr. Brown's black cherry instead that I like too, uh, which I remember from my Jewish grandmother's house. Peter Lazaro asks, did you ever worry that turning your passion into your profession would ruin it for you? Peter, actually, I never did worry because there was gonna be nothing but doing this. There's no way that I was gonna turn my back on it. There was no way it wasn't gonna work. I was just gonna keep on going forward, so I never even thought about that. But, and I didn't even realize how much my passion would make it enjoyable for me. It, not until I actually you know, opened up and started making pizza that people really appreciated and you know, had good things to say about that I realized uh, I was gonna enjoy it so much. You know, people ask me about my commute. I say, well, it really doesn't bother me that I'm traveling 40 miles each way each day because it's not like I'm coming to work. And that's the way I feel. And it's because of this, you know, I followed something that I love and I'm good at. And, um, you know, I wouldn't give this up for the world. I appreciate you uh, checking in. I just want to tell all of you who are thinking about doing something like this that you absolutely can do it. Whether you think you can or you think you can't, you're right. And I'd encourage you to, to follow your dreams as I did. And if you need any help following your dreams, you know where to find me. I'll be glad to help.